I'm Bob Smool, and since 1980 I have taught at the University of Notre Dame in the Department of American Studies. I have uh, been fortunate enough to uh, not only teach journalism, but to actively engage in it in a number of different ways, both for print and uh, in broadcasting. Today's journalistic environment is so varied and there's so many different uh, sources that it's really incumbent upon each of us as a citizen to take the initiative to understand our country and uh, the world. I think that, uh, that really at this particular time, this is the, uh, uh, the crisis of American print journalism. Quality journalism will continue in this country, but the people who are responsible for quality journalism are going to need to find the best way to deliver it to the public. Someone who is going into uh, print journalism today needs to understand the fundamentals, needs to know how to write effectively and well. But beyond that, one has to uh, understand that there are a number of different platforms, a number of different ways of delivering journalism. And so one needs to write well, always but one needs to adapt that writing for print, for online, for uh, broadcast. So it's a matter of writing across the media that really uh, will determine whether or not someone who's going into journalism uh, today is going to be successful uh, or not. Social media expand the territory of journalism. And by that I mean that there are a number of instances where having social media allowed for the reporting of events. Take for example uh, the election and its aftermath in Iran uh, not terribly long ago. It was largely through social media that the world found out what had happened. So I think that uh, in certain respects, when we, when we talk about uh, citizen journalism, uh, we have to take it seriously. Where I think we all have to be cautious is in taking it too seriously. Um, we have to be aware of it, but we also have to be very certain that the information that we're, we're receiving uh, is accurate, uh, has been well-researched, has a basis in, uh, in fact. So much of, uh, of what we see today would be opinion or commentary. And I think uh, more than anything, we need uh, facts uh, to learn about uh, complicated issues. Today, with all of the different sources, including those that would be on the internet and on uh, various news networks and really across talk radio and many other platforms, there are so many different possibilities that it is up to us as individuals to select what is important, what we need as uh, a society in order to be informed.